everybody. I love the title of this film. It's so poetic. The Sun is also a star, of course. And you saw this movie. You Watch and Roger it. got a chance to see this. I didn't get a chance. I was out of town when we were doing this. Uh, Rena, one of our producers, got a chance to sit down with the staff, or the staff, the cast yeah. as well. Yara Shahidi and Charles Melton. It's like a teen romance kind of thing. But you say there's so much more to it. Yeah, it's very thoughtful. And mm. it makes you like think about life in general and the decisions you make and why and where you end up because of them. Mm -hmm. So it was really philosophical. It was yeah. cool. And when they sat down with Rena, they, they kind of said, you know, this gave them another perspective on their own personal lives yeah. as well. Have a look. What if I told you I could get you to fall in love with me? Just give me a day. An hour. I believe that, you know, everything happens for a reason. You may not understand why something happens, but, you know, maybe a week from now, a year from now, things will all make sense. You just got to trust in the process. I usually put it within the terms of manifestation and being purpose-driven and orientation. What you put out in the world is what you receive. And what The Sun is also a star is putting out to the world is a look at love and circumstance. Shahidi and Melton star as Natasha and Daniel, two strangers who meet by chance on an ordinary day in New York City. Natasha, who is a very pragmatic quantum physics student, is hesitant about spending the day with a poetic stranger. But sparks fly. What's the X factor? Don't worry, we've got it. You and I. But initially, it seems like they don't complement each other. Like there's no possible way we'd ever connect. And you end up finding that there's space within both of our beliefs for their to not only connect with one another, but to develop a love. They're just a version of each other, like we're all versions of each other. However, there's a catch. Natasha and her family are facing deportation, so her time with Daniel is quickly running out. I'm really grateful to be able to be in a story in which we touch on the uh, importance of discussing immigration, the importance of discussing deportation, but from the point of view of investing in each character and from the point of view of really talking about the humans that are affected rather than the policies that are put into effect. Humanizes it. And you know, you see juggling two different identities, you know, with, you know, Daniel's character and wanting to make either make accommodate his parents and their ambitions and dreams for him or his own ambitions and dreams is, you know, I think something we can all relate to. All we have is a single day. Both sun of them. Is, yeah, Sun is also a star. There are two stars right there. Chiseled cheekbones, yeah. both of them. Beautiful yeah. on the screen. Yara Shahidi and Charles Melton. You can check out that film starting on Friday tomorrow. Yeah. Olivia Wilde, she's add her to the list of actors turned directors. Her directorial debut, it's called Book Smart. We're going to talk about that tomorrow. Saw it yesterday afternoon. You did? And also loved it and loved the soundtrack. They're all bringing up the soundtrack. The soundtracks game. are key right yes. now for all of these films, especially when you have, you know, that kind of romantic feel to it or that nostalgic feel with mm -hmm. some of these. It's, it's massive. It drives the, the plot and it's just, it's exciting. Mm -hmm. Okay. And she's amazing yeah. as a director in that. We'll awesome. be back with more BT right after this.